What's up my party people, it's your boy Kenneth G coming to you with The Walking Dead Season 2. I forget what episode it is, but it's been a while. I know some people have been suggesting that I play this again. I always intend on finishing it. It's just new games have been coming out and I've been playing them and my friends have been sharing it. Yeah, I gotta do this. This game is awesome. I just needed a little time controlling the character for a while. Alright, let's jump into this because I know y'all are excited. Bam! Previously on The Walking Dead. I'm freezing. Wait till we get up to Wellington. Then talk to me about cold. Now I'm gonna go look for more wood. Where's the rest of your group? I I'm by myself. Bullshit! Krista, run! Krista, no! <laughs> It's all your fault! I'm out! Grab her, let's go! Would someone mind telling me what the fuck is going on here? She was hey, language lady! So we know she could be working with Carver. So, Bob. since you're pretty much on your own, what's your plan? Smack you in the face? I don't know. I'm kind of on my own now. Well, you're welcome to stay here if you want. Jesus, Mary. I wanna, Jesus. I wanna, I want. Oh, I Think remember. About it. You're Carver, what do you do? We chose to go with the Who's old Carver? man. Even though he is clearly bitten and it was the you wrong were choice. In the woods with Krista. Please. And I didn't give this man ah. water. He... I'm fine. He killed I'm my fine. friend Krista. Just, just lost my footing. Damn it. God damn it. Why did I go with him? I don't know. Come this way. Damn it, you get your asses over here, both of you! Boom! Bloosh! Let's get to the game, y'all! Nick! Hold on! Nick! God damn it! Nick! Nick! We have to go! <laughs> All right, it's time to play. Gameplay is going to be a lot smoother because I'm using a different recording software, and thank God for this recording software because, man, Fraps just took a chunk out of my FPS like nobody's missed this. Now this one, it's a lot easier on the FPS. Which, if you don't know, that means frames per second. Come on, zombos! You ain't bad like me. You get well, in here, I'll take care of you. On the downside, we can't get through them. How's your bit leg? Your buffoon. What are you looking at? Your bit leg, fool. What do you think? Staring ain't polite. Come on out and say it. What are you going to do? Hand me that there. Chop, he's gonna chop it off? Oh shit. Give him the saw. If he wants to do it, let him do it. He's gonna it's gonna suck. He's not gonna be able to walk anywhere. He's gonna be a liability for everybody. Woo! Is he gonna do it? Does he have the balls? Uh, nope. Bleed out like a stuck pig. What are you gonna do? Carry me out of here on your back? Hell. It's just... Just give me a minute. Try to get some rest. There's a lot of stuff in here. I'll try to find something to help. Cause I'm Clementine. I'm like MacGyver's freaking daughter. Okay, we got control. What are we gonna do? We got our backpack back. Look, look in there. What 
a gold watch isn't gonna do anything. Uh, there's water. Take the water. <coughs> Is there any left? Anything in that? Ah. Uh, <coughs> give it Not to much. Me. Here. Thanks. Don't chug it all, you fuck! I'll keep looking around. There ain't nothing else in here except for a stupid watch. Whee! Alright. What else is in this truck of terror? Anything? Anything? Hello? Hello? Okay, okay. We got keys! What else we got? Anything? A radio. Let's look at the radio for some reason. Okay, that didn't do nada. Look at the keys. The keys are still in it. Oh, very well, cool. Worth a shot. Yeah. <laughs> Start her up. Sounds like it's gonna. Out of gas. Maybe. You gotta pump that gas. Get in the seat. Try it again. Oh, I can't try it again. Damn it. There ain't nothing else to look at. Right here. Um, look in the box, please. What's Red gold, there? original flavor. Anything we can use? Cigarettes. Give me one of those. Probably tastes like pine tar by now, but I'd smoke a dead coon's tail if you had one. <laughs> you got a light? Actually, there's one in the backpack, I think. Oh. Ladder up! <laughs> well, smoking that bad tastes for about you. as bad as it smells. <laughs> now what? I can't believe one of the choices were, show me how. As in, show me how to smoke. Horrible! Freaking Telltale Games. What are you thinking? Are you trying to breed a whole new genre of smokers? I wish I never picked up a cigarette in my life. It's the worst choice I ever made. What are, we, are we sleeping? What's going on? Is he a zombified yet? Oh, you better. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh shit, grab something. Grab the saw? Is that the only thing we got? What are you gonna do, swing a saw at him? Just grab it. Uh, look at him. What's going on with him, man? Are you alive? <laughs> Barely. <laughs> oh, damn it. I feel like ten pounds of shit in a five pound sack. <laughs> oh, great. <laughs> Jesus. Stuck in this can the whole damn day. You want to hear something funny? I've been thinking. That you might not turn. I don't want to die. <laughs> well, uh, a little late for that, brother. <clears throat> I never thought I'd be the kind of idiot to say something like that. But there it is. Idiot? I don't think I'm anyone scared, really wants Clementine. to die. Jesus, I'm scared. What does it feel like? Uh, it feels said. like ten pounds of shit like a rope and five pounds my neck. I'm getting tighter every second. It feels like I can't <coughs> breathe. Can't breathe. Would you? Would you promise me you'll watch out for Nick? I pledge I allegiance to Nick. I love that stupid Nick. kid. No matter what you think, he is a good boy. I'll do what I can. Thank you. 
Pete will remember that today. for the rest Thank of his God short us. life. Where are you going? You gonna go kill some zombies while you have a chance, or what? I'm not getting out of this. You're gonna have to make a break. You're I knew it. Gonna thanks. have to make a break for thanks it. Thanks for being my bait, brother. I'll buy you some time. Thank you, Pete. You go find my nephew now, right? Ten four, we'll old buddy. And run straight to the woods. Just keep moving. All right. I'll be like a freaking track star, buddy. Don't you worry. I got my jet boots on, son. Let's get this over with. Lure them toward the van. Bust out like a half zombified Rambo. Do a couple round kicks, head butts. Run! What kind of. <laughs> Boom, bitch! Get out, whoa. Get out the way. Get out the way, bitch. Get out the way. I'm the quick time master. New morning achievement. Episode 2, A House Divided. Clementine, track star of the world, post-apocalyptic gold medal. Clementine, are you alright? Luke's not with you? Where's Alvin? What happened? It's been hours. Where are they? Clem! We got attacked. By who? Walkers. Jesus! We all got split up. I was with Pete, but... My God. Where were you? Where were you exactly? Down by the stream. We gotta go. Just hold on a minute. My husband is still out there! Get husband. the guns! Luke and Alvin went out looking for you. I told them not to go. Damn it, Luke. Oh, snap. Clementine, can you, can so, you please watch Sarah? So you're going to leave me alone She's upstairs. More. Just distract her and don't tell her anything. She gets nervous. I'll take care of her. You can trust me. Thank you. You'll be safe inside. Just don't open the doors for anything. We'll be back soon. And... Thank you. Check, check one, check two. Thank you for trusting me, finally. That, that pregnant chick does not Say like cheese. me. Cheddar! I found this under the house. There was all kinds of old stuff. Great, going under the house, not a good suggestion. It's so cool. Take one of me. Come on, take one of me. Sure. I'll be freaking nice. Get to me you. in a good pose, okay? Okay, I'm ready. What's wrong? Um, where's my dad? Um Clem, you're scaring me. They're just fishing. I know that's not true. What do you know? Sorry, I, I, I just need to... I mean, you told me not to tell her, so... what? She need, we need to know what this girl knows. I mean, she really needs to be up to date, but I don't want to piss Doc Holliday off. You want to see what I found? Will you show me how to use it? Oh, outstanding. I couldn't find any books. Playing with guns. If something's wrong, I should know. What if I have to use one? 
Nobody tells me anything. It's too dangerous. Everything is dangerous. I need to know sometime. You should let your dad teach you. What should I shoot? Get Don't the, do what that. the fuck? Point it at me! Sorry, sorry. You crazy Maybe I could practice Mongolian. outside. You There's that God. tree. Hey, Luke's back. Freaking crazy girl pointing a gun at my face? God, someone needs to slap some sense into that woman. Anything over here? I can't go that way. Invisible wall. Um, look out the window. Okay. Um, well, I, I guess I go this way. She looks very scared. <laughs> oh, hey! I don't think it's Luke. That's not Luke. Great. Hide. Clem, I think I know him. Who? What? He can't see me. You have to make him go away. Who is he? Uh, I, I don't remember. Oh. Clem, I can't breathe. I, I can't breathe. Shh. Shut up. You can girl wonder. Oh, I should have told her to go hide. Ah. Uh, Anybody home? Can't I just Hello. Oh shit. I locked oh, it. I tried to lock it. Get out of here now. Is that how your dad taught you to greet a neighbor? This I've got a gun. A smart girl. I would too. But I'm not a bad guy, honey. Promise you that. My family and I are set up a ways down river. I'm kind of surprised we haven't run into each other yet. What's your name? Lie. I'm Carly. Carly. That's a sweet name. You mind if I come in? Hey! Carly. I've been out all morning and this heat has got me cooked. Yes, I do mind. Dude, this is a nice place. Is there anyone else around? You don't usually see cabins this big out here. Sure could pack a lot of folks in there. Just me and, and Dad. Yeah? What's his name? Ed. Strong name. I like him already. Where is he? He's out. Well, I'll cut to the chase. I'm out looking for my people. Seven of them, to be exact. They've been gone a long while, and I'm worried they might have gotten lost. Maybe you've seen them. A couple of farm boys and an old man. Spanish guy and his daughter. Quiet girl. A bit taller than you. Big black guy. This big. And a pretty little pregnant lady. I saw them. They're dead. You saw who? Where? Down by the river the other day. Walkers got them. I'm sorry. <laughs> the river? You sure about that? Pretty sure. Well, no offense, but I guess that wasn't them. Because the ones I'm looking for are very careful people. <laughs> if you say so. This dude. Get the... What kind of manners do you have? I'm not a bad guy, but I'm going to go through your house anyway. So you're going to do everything that portrays that you are a bad guy. Get the hell out of my house, you freak. Your stupid jacket and... Ugh. It's a lot of plates for two people. Looks like a tornado ran through here. Yeah, cause I don't like to do yeah. dishes, well, fuckface. I'm supposed to be doing the dishes. Just passing through or you have been here a while? Hey, listen, kid. I hope you're not one of those nuts headed up north looking for Shangri-La. I'm not sure why you'd go anywhere after finding this place. Where do you live? Yeah, down by the river there. There's a sweet little spot with a boat where we pitched camp. Got a few tents up and everything else. And like I said, I'm surprised we haven't run into each other. Do you have a dog? No, I don't. What difference does it make? Just wondering.
<laughs> he sees me eyeballing the knife. Where does this go? Oh, I'll take it. Ay, ay, ay. Get out of my house, dude! What's wrong That's with a real you? nice place. Kind of cozy. That's great. Get out! First, get I knew the chest a guy that always wore shirts like this. Doctor. Real smug, son of a bitch. But a smart man. I miss him. What's his name? Carlos. Well, well. White's in trouble. Three moves away from checkmate. What was that? Dude, come on, you're cramping my style. I thought you said nobody's here. I didn't hear anything. Ah! Sorry, y'all, I didn't mean to probably hurt your ears. This dude, this dude is infuriating, homie. You are straight out of line. This dude must be the man that everyone was talking about and they're hiding from, obviously, since he's looking for them. Fucking. I told you, nobody's here. Seems that way. Didn't mean to be rude. Yeah, you did. Couldn't just leave you here with a good conscience if someone was poking around, right? You're poking sure. around. Sure. Who's this? Must be someone who lived here. Must be. You Don't have no idea me, like, who these people are. A bag do you? of smashed assholes. I don't know what you're talking about. Let me ask you this. When you met them, how much did they trust you? Triple dot. Well, I think I've troubled you long enough. I can let myself out. Yeah, I, I, I hope so, you old bastard. Don't come back. You have a real good day now. I don't give a damn if he remembers it. Write it down. Take a picture, you rude old bastard. He? He's gone. Get out of the window. What if he comes back? He better not. We have bullets that gun, I'd have freaking put some lead in him. We need to find the others. We can't go outside. <laughs> Clementine. Sarah. They told me about Pete. You know where he is, right? Come on, let's go. A man was here. What? What did she say? Someone came to the cabin. What? Clementine talked to him. And you just opened the door for him? Calm he down, Rebecca. In. Calm down? I am calm. You calm down. I didn't open the door. He just came in. She's telling the truth. Did he say his name? Did he say what his name was? Maybe it wasn't him. You know damn well who it was. Did he say his name? I didn't ask his name. You didn't ask his name? How could you not ask his name? He had a gun. I didn't want to make him mad. Look, Clem, just tell us what he looked like. What was he wearing? Did he sound different? He had a big brown coat. Did it have a lining? A collar? Yeah, fur. He talked about you, Dad. Yep. You're not gonna hurt anyone, are you? Of course he won't, Sarah. Right, your dad's the nicest man I know, which is why he's not gonna do anything crazy or not nice, right? You know these are bad people, sweetie. They will do or say anything to hurt us. All right, what do you think? Did it seem like he'd be coming back? He saw a picture of me. 
A picture? What were you doing taking pictures? Carlos. What? You need to calm down. All right, you're scaring your daughter. You told me to distract her. Distract? Sarah. So I'm just an idiot? I thought we were friends. He was scouting. We got lucky. He wasn't expecting to find us. Clementine must have surprised him. She hadn't been there. That's right, I well, took care of business. too smart to stick around, but he'll be back with the rest. We don't have much time. He's right. Everyone pack up. We're moving now. Alvin, wait! We have to leave now, sweetie, before he comes back with more bad guys. But it's gonna be okay. Let's just go get your things. What does he want? To bring us back. Clem, what? I don't know what he told you, but you William Carver a is a dangerous man. He's the leader of a camp not far from here, and he's very smart. We were lucky to escape. Look, I'm sorry to involve you, but now that he's seen you, you'll be safer with us. We have to leave. We have to find Pete. We'll get him on he's the way dead. out, Nick. Clementine, you know where he was, right? Yeah. All right. Everybody grab your stuff. Let's hit the road. Pete is zombified. Or dead. You said it was just up here? Well, I guess it's the same thing. Yeah, just a little ways. Hey, Clem. Sorry if I gave you some shit back there. I'm just a little on edge. It's just a tough time right now with the pregnancy and all. It's okay. If it's not you I'm yelling at lately, it's Alvin. And then I'm in real trouble. I can handle it. I'm not a little kid. I felt the same way when I was your age. My dad was always giving me shit. And I always thought he didn't know a damn thing. <laughs> and I think the same about you. I know you did you. your best back there. You know, none of us would make it on our own. Sometimes it's hard knowing just how dependent and I am I on can. everyone. And I can. So you guys suck. I'm not used to that. I'm not comfortable with that. I'm supposed to be a mom soon. Guess I need to work on my patience. Yeah. Alvin and I a still little. don't know what to call her. Or him if that man gets his wish. God help me. Any ideas? Clem? There's the truck, and there's Pete. Dead. Or maybe it's not Pete. I don't know. There's dead people there. everywhere. That's where we were. A little collection of post-apocalyptic warfare. He's not in here. This was the last place I saw him. Maybe he's around here somewhere. Well, sorry. Keep your eyes open and stay in sight. Where'd you go, Peter? Oh, blood trail. That be his direction, I'd say. And uh, I'd say he's losing a shit ton of blood, so uh, the chances of him Pete. being alive are very slim, I'm thinking. I want to run, damn it. Anyone see him? Oh, is this him? Oh, shit. Intestines everywhere. It's a new game of Connect 4, except we're connecting intestines to places they will not oh fit anymore. Oh, my God. W what happened? What the hell happened? He's been shot. Shot? He didn't have a gun. Oh. Who did this? This puts a nice little spin on it. Son of a bitch. We need to go. He's gone. Nick, he, he, he's gone. You gotta get moving. Come on, man. <laughs> no, Pete. The grayest shade of skin tone on you right now it looked so beautiful in the direct sunlight. It glistened in the sun. We miss Tell you. Me. <laughs> Tell me how it happened. He was scared and... Scared? My uncle? He got bit. Back, back in the stream. Fuck you. No way. 
Yes, Nick. it happened. Eddie. Come on, man. How about Fuck off. No thanks. Fuck you. Nick, quit being a bitch. Buck up, sucker. I'm worried about that kid. Keep an eye on him for me, would you? Everyone wants me you, to keep an eye on him. Sure, you still want to come with us? Isn't he a grown ass man? Look, I know we got off to a rough start, and I can't make any promises it won't get rougher. Yeah, I'm with you guys. And we are glad to have you. Not everyone is. Uh, well, well, they'll get there. I figure we got about four or five days to reach those mountains. Y'all need me. Now, I'm if they're tracking off. us, we should be able to lose them up there. Five days? It's gonna be okay, Beck. We have to keep moving now. It's our only choice. Yep, yep. God, I'm glad this game's running a lot better. Yeah, well, uh, I'm gonna leave the episode there, my party peeps. So, uh, when we come back next episode, you'll see what happened five days later. So, if you like this post-apocalyptic walking dead season two episode make sure you headbutt that like button subscribe for your friends and for yourself make sure you follow me on twitter for all updates and fun stuff link is always in the description and i want to thank you for diving through those internet cables to see me 10fg peace out y'all <laughs> Oh wow! Oh wow! <laughs> Dear God! <laughs>